In a 9,000 kilowatt hydroelectric plant, the overall efficiency is 88%. And the actual power received by the customer is 110,000 kilowatt hours for that day. So first we have our work for our hydroelectric plant and an overall efficiency of 88% and the actual power received by the customer is 110,000 kilowatt hours for that day. What is the secondary power could this plant deliver during the entire day? So what is secondary power? Well, that is simply the power consumed by the plant itself. So things like lighting, emergency systems, pumps, uh, offices and all that. And everything else is primary power. So this means this is our primary power. Because that is the one that is received by our customer. So let's say this is P1 or our primary power. Now we're trying to look for our secondary power in kilowatt hours. And we're being asked to find it for the entire day. So let's say T is equal to 24 hours per day. Now by definition, by definition, secondary power is what you get by subtracting the plant's capacity by the primary power. So first we need to actually find our plant capacity. That is simply equal to work times the overall efficiency times our time. So plant capacity is wet. And we get a plant capacity of 190,000 kilowatt hours. So, to find our primary power, we subtract, or rather, to find our secondary power, we subtract the primary power from our plant capacity. So, we already have both of these. Now, if we put that in our calculator, we arrive at a secondary power of 80,080 kilowatt hours for our electric hydroelectric plant. And that is our final answer.